Hi, my name is Gent and in this video I will show you the build-up and explain the operating principle of a strain gauge torque sensor and give a few examples for which measurement tasks you can use these shaft sensors. Without giving too much away, in addition to torque, this sensor can also provide precise speed and angle measurement. Here we can see a torque sensor and selected components. The core of the sensor is the measuring shaft, which consists of a special hardened steel. Four strain gauges are bonded to the so-called torsional track, which are interconnected to a Wheatstone measuring bridge. Strain gauges are small measuring elements for detecting relative changes in length and use the physical effect that the electrical resistance of a wire changes in proportion to its elongation when stretched or compressed. If a torque is applied to the measuring shaft, two strain gauges are always stretched and the other two compressed, causing the resistance of the strain gauges to change in opposite direction. From these changes in resistance, the elongation of the strain gauges and thus the acting torque can be derived. As the measuring shaft rotates during the measurement, the power supply for the strain gauges and the electrical signals must be transmitted from the rotating shaft to the electronics. This can be realized using either slip ring contacts or so-called telemetric systems, which transfer the acquired measurement data wireless via inductive couplings and provide the necessary supply energy simultaneously without signal distortion and maintenance free. Finally, the transmitted data is processed in the stator and converted into an analog or digital output signals via the integrated AD converter. In addition to the torque signal, this sensor offers also a speed and angle measurement. The absolute angle measurement system includes a magnet wheel, a sensor board with two sensors and a sophisticated signal processing. How does this work now? The magnet wheel has north and south poles disturbed around the circumference with a fixed width. The two sensors on the sensor board are aligned at a defined distance and detect the alternating north and south poles. Due to the defined alignment of the sensors to each other, two identical signals are generated, which are time shifted. With this information, the angle, speed and direction of rotation are determined by an intelligent evaluation. The high resolution angle system with a tolerance of 0.03 degree is always used when the torque must be determined at an exact position. For example, in end-of-line testing of combustion engines and electric motors, gearboxes and various pump tests in production. Alright, I know that was a lot of input in a short time. After watching this video, if you are interested in, for example, how the angle measurement works in detail or in other measurement technology devices and methods, you can check on our website. Or simply contact us directly. Our sales guys and application specialists are very happy to help you. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.